it's time to learn about the modified block style of correspondence. You'll notice I have instructions for correspondence 50, 32 open on the right, and that is found on the textbook page 164. The first step is to clear all tabs and set a left tab at the center point, that is 3.25 inches. So we move to the paragraph dialog box on your home tab. The tabs button in the left lower corner. Click clear all and then type 3.25 inches in the tab stop position. Be sure it is set on left with no leaders and press set. Then pr click OK. And you will notice right there in the middle, basically the middle of the page, is the left tab appearing on your ruler. If you do not have the ruler on, please open the ruler at this time. Now we will begin our letter. Let me turn on show hide. Second step, press enter five times to begin the first line of the letter two inches from the top of the page. One, two, three, four, five. Then we're going to press tab one time to move to the center point and type the date of the letter. And then we press enter four times, one, two, three, four, and type the inside address single spaced at the left margin. Step five, press enter two times, type the salutation at the left margin. And press enter two times again. Now we will type the paragraphs blocked at the left margin and press enter two times after all paragraphs to insert a blank line between paragraphs. After typing the final paragraph, press enter two times and press tab one time to move to the center point. Type the complementary closing and then press enter four times. One, two, three, four. Press tab one time to move to the center point and type the writer's identification. And if, as in this case, the writer's identification is to be typed on two lines, press enter once and tab one time again for any additional line. Press enter two times and type the reference initials at the left margin. Type your reference initials where you see URS, and this must match what you have entered under personal information in GDP. Press enter one time, and I'm going to press undo in order to change that capital U, which word inserted would be your first initial, back to lowercase. Then we're going to type the enclosure notation. Press enter one time and type the copy notation at the left margin. Word likes to capitalize these initials. You need to be sure that you have reverted them to lowercase. All right, at this point, resist the temptation to space or press enter again. Return to GDP to check your errors. All of them should be corrected to zero including your reference initials, which, as I said, must match the GDP options under personal information and be lowercase.